Hi, good morning, good evening, good afternoon, and good night, depending upon what time you watch this video. My name is Justine. I do unboxings of luxury pre-loved items that I happen to find here in Japan, or brand new items that I happen to get while living here in Japan. Um, so today I'm going to do a re-unboxing. Um, I had previously videotaped this and it somehow got lost in translation. Um, but I wanted to show something else that I've added new to my collection that I was really excited about. Uh, as most of you guys know, you guys saw my carry all bag um, edition and my unboxing there. And that was a really big excitement for me to get finally in my collection. And there was also something else that I was able to get um, to add to my collection as well. So today I'm going to show you guys a beautiful piece of luggage. I'm really excited and I'm actually excited to add more of these to my collection. Um, so I happened to pick up a Cruiser 45 um, while thrifting here and living here in Japan. So this is a beautiful, beautiful piece of Louis Vuitton craftsmanship as well as a beautiful piece of Louis Vuitton luggage. So the Cruiser, um, it actually is built to be packed and sit up like a box. So you actually end up filling the entire portion of this. Um, and it actually sits up like a box, not necessarily like a trunk, but a box. So I was really excited to find this. This is a Cruiser 45, and I was able to find this on the Japanese pre-love market. Um, I was looking for, I was looking for the carry-all, honestly, and I couldn't find it, and I kept looking for it, and I kept looking for it, and I couldn't find it. And then I ended up finding this beautiful Cruiser 45, um, which I ended up paying less than $550 for, which was also a really big excitement. Um, and this bag came in like practically brand new shape. Um, I did some cleaning, I did some conditioning of the leather. Um, this bag is not vintage by any means. Um, it's actually a 2001 bag. So it's almost vintage, but not quite. Um, once we hit next year, then it'll be vintage because vintage is, you know, once it's 20 years or older. Um, this was made on the eighth week of 2001. So uh, for how old this bag is, this bag is 19 years old. Um, this was actually in very, very good shape. So I found it from a pre-loved, um, pre-loved seller online, uh, actually went on like eBay Japan and found it and picked this up and snagged this up in a heartbeat. And I'm really excited because it came with its dust cover. Um, those of you guys that watch a lot of my old, my other videos, you know that I'm a, I'm a fiend for dust covers because I like being able to keep, um, my bags new. I like being able to keep them. Um, protected as well as not having any issues or any damage with them when I travel or when I transfer or when I uh, do my pack outs whenever I happen to move houses. So that is the 45. I'm going to see if I can pluck this up for you guys and show you just like how beautiful this bag looks um, puffed up. So give me two seconds and I will find something to puff this up for you. All right, there you go. It was magic. I happen to make it happen. So this is what it looks like when it's fully like packed out. It looks like a beautiful box. And this is just, I'm really excited. Um, I don't know how, I don't know if this will actually count as like a carry-on. So I was going to try and see if I can get this as a carry-on um, the next time I happen to travel. But of course, you know, coronavirus. So no traveling here recently, but uh, definitely will be taking this on my road trips. Um, whenever, excuse me, whenever I happen to finally get a chance to do a road trip, um, I'll be taking some of my road trips and packing this in my bag. So will definitely be like an overnight bag. Um, really excited about this. Super happy. The leather looks amazing. I've already conditioned it once. I've already cleaned it once. Um, now it's just time to actually put this bad boy to work, which I'll be able to do once we actually get back into the swing of actually being able to travel. So I always say this, but I'm always like, really excited to add new things to my collection. I'm always excited to add new luggage pieces to my collection because that's one thing I always found that I was missing. I had the one duffel bag for a very long time, but like, I mean, this is beautiful. My carry-all is beautiful. My other duffel bags are amazing and adding the flexibility and the versatility of having different patterns for different sizes for different things just makes all the world a difference. So. I'm really excited about adding this to my collection. Um, thank you for joining me on my channel. I hope you guys enjoyed the video as much as I enjoyed making it. If you liked it, please go ahead and smash the like button and please subscribe so that way you can get notifications of any time that I post new videos. And as always, I wish you as much luck as I have had doing hunting. Um, so as always, happy treasure hunting with your vintage looks.